Vroom vroom fast dot dem. I think I might do that one. Okay, whoa. O W uh Vroom Vroom Fast give Bob's uh Vroom Vroom Fast. That's that is the best description of this run. Vroom Vroom Fast. Good morning. You have been in suspension for I already did them sushi w dot them. regulations. All testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental huh. wellness exercise. You will hear about oh, this meme of a game. Buzzer, look right. up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastics Forehead. of your mandatory physical I already started though. <laughs> There With vroom vroom fast. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. I had to vroom vroom fast. Okay, now so. Mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art, wow. not provided the required intellectual sustenance. Reflect briefly on this chess game is sad. Now, please return to your bed. Spelling it correct? Do you actually mean, like, the word forehead? Or, like... Good morning. You have been in suspension for... Nine, oh, nine, 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 nine. 4H. I'm in a speed run. Are you okay? I'm going very fast. I can't do that. I'm actually sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just hmm. take it slow. Stay calm, stay, stay calm, wait, wait. What? Dialogue was missed. There was... That was weird. Okay, so... So that king has what is it, four legal moves, it looks like. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration. And I'm, I'm queening in like now, two you've moves. Been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarmed, try to although hold actually, you, because that is the proper reaction to being. I might not be queening. <laughs> do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Hang on, let me think. Okay, you know what? So, That's close enough. Just hold tight. Pawn there. All reactor core safeguards then are now non-functional. Bishop takes. Then I go pawn there. Then Bishop okay, look, goes there. Is taken. Again, but Bishop goes there. I queen. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? Okay, I'm good. I'm the good. Anybody in the chat want to play chess? Hold on, this is a bit tricky. On the phone? And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? Have I got enough space? Uh, just, just got to get through here. I just got to concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here? You bathe in the tears of foreign monks, ships to you overnight from remote villages in France. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry. But if anyone That's asks, a lot of monks. Tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. All right, not dead. But not chess. Okay, almost oh. there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I don't know if chess I think this is a docking was a mistype, but I meant chess, like the board game. For high IQ individuals. Good news, that is not a docking station. So there's 
Chili, how do you maintain such an exotic lifestyle? I couldn't. Chess is for low IQ. Honey Pop unrated is for highest IQ. Technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two. One. Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. You have just passed through an Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grill, which vaporizes most Aperture Science equipment that touches it. down your neck. Relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Minor if. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has One day you're skydiving with Saudi princes in the United Arab Emirates. The next day you're buying rare and exotic artifacts from the Ming Dynasty. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable... I mean, you live you, man, but... I mean, all this for like a Half-Life speedrunner. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. <laughs> this next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth Oof. jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. You have trapped yourself. Congratulations. The exit door is now open. Fortnite Zoom Walk. Center is currently being bombarded well, I can't afford Fortnite, so I don't know. From space. Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate. Well done. The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional. Somebody gets me enough bits to buy Fortnite, then I'll volts. play it. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God, if you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, okay. And remember, testing is the future, and the future starts with you. Good work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you. 
Please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're out of options here. So get ready to catch me, all right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? One. Two. Sell overpriced three. organic it's beans. To Philly rich oh, hipster in Oregon. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Get me, get out! I am not dead! I'm not dead! <laughs> Point me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. Oh no. Yes, hello, no, we're not stopping. Don't make contact, why are you doing? No, thanks, we're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. Sell overpriced organic beans to Philly rich hipster in Oregon. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're gonna have to go through her chamber. And she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna go in there. Don't don't go in there. Don't, she, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. Oh my god. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she is, honestly. Ah! Oh, still held, still being held. You, that's a great Whoops. job. You've applied the. Ah! I just sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I just done it again. This is the main breaker room. Look for a video game. That says Can you? Escape pod. Oh, filthy. Not anything else. Yeah. Not okay, anything else. that makes don't more sense. Don't, you, don't even look at anything else. Just well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something, it doesn't say escape pod. Look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at. That makes a lot more sense. Thing. You understand? Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. I mean, toast. I can't sell you lima beans, but I'm sure chili and such can. Be light. That's uh, God. Oh, look at that. It's turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Now, escape pod, escape pod. It's, it's moving up. Okay, okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. This should slow it down. No, makes it go faster. Uh oh. Power up the Yeah, issue. like, okay, I speedrun the game, and I don't pay attention to what they said, because I've heard it hundreds of times. But, like, it's a funny game. So. The dialogue. What was that? What? She not saying anything. Again. Hello. Say though that since you went to all the trouble of waking She's not up, saying anything. Really, really love the same lima beans they're gonna start growing on Mars. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. One million six hundred thousand dollars per pound. Three point five pounds per transaction. If four million eight hundred. Five million six hundred dollars. <laughs> Five million eight hundred dollars. Five million six hundred dollar minimum. The incinerator room. For those lima beans. 
that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around mm. here somewhere. Once you find where it is. Huh. I've literally gone so much. I need to work on that. There. Good. You have the dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area of a once testing starts. I'm required by need to work on that so much. Interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. But the important thing is you're back with me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. Okay, you know what? So I'm, gonna, I'm just going to redo that. See how they work. There should be one. Well done. That shouldn't have happened, Here come the but test results. we're fine. You are a horrible person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. So, assuming they move that, then I move that, and then they're boned. Basically. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on congratulations. Yeah. Not on the test. Most what people I... emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Uh, Gladys? It's Ellen McLean. The voice is Gladys in both games. One moment. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, we don't have to go that slowly. I've watched too many, too much developer commentary. Listen to, I should say. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of the room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I, I've heard enough I developer commentary. Oh, I just played the best move of my life. Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Completely on accident. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers, so sometimes there's still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. 
and I'm sorry. Okay. You didn't react at the time, so, so I was there's chapter of three. Which then big out of bounds. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Then And then the fifty nine fifty seven. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry, I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Oops. Every death chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. All right. Let's go fast. its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. Hello, where? Oh my god, really? Wow. I'm being scammed. I've been scammed. This next test, I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. Well, you passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. Excellent. You're a predator, and these tests are your prey. Speaking of which, oh. I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess sharks? Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody, Nobody but, but you, you is that, that pointlessly cool. cool. Good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I saved recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future okay. generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone structure. Well done. Slightly fact, unnerving. It's so well, I'm going to note this on your file in the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. Perfect. This 
This next test involves turrets. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh, ring. That's you in five seconds. Good luck. doing a good speed run can maintain a constant testing cycle I simulate daylight at all hours and add adrenal vapor to your oxygen supply so you may be confused about the passage of time the point is yesterday was your birthday I thought you'd want to know you know how I'm going to live forever, but you're going to be dead in 60 years. Okay, bye. I've been working on a belated Hang on. birthday present. Hang on. You. Well, more of a belated birthday medical okay. procedure. Okay, bye, demonimator. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. Okay, there's like one second. Half a second. Well, bye, demona demonimator. Oh. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people it looks fine. But right here a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. Well, what does an ex bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. It's a she. I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. A man and a woman. So, so that's, that's interesting. interesting. It's a small world. I'm pretty sure whatever he does, he's it's gone. It's not Okay. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling me would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. Okay, pull the rug up next. It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. That's that's a no. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. Oops. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. Here we go. Let's get it. Initiating surprise in three, two, one. I made it all up. Surprise. Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. Okay. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. There we go. Like that. Like that. Cool, I didn't die. I even went out of bounds. And I went in bounds. It's a Christmas miracle. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. Minus 15. Yeah, that strat is powerful. Okay. 
and then going in bed. And I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Because it's like, it's kind of weird. I don't know what that strat, I don't know how it works. But I did it. So. That's cool. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty Aww. good. That's right. The facility is... I think these test chambers look even yeah. better than they did before. It was easy, really. You just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. Yeah, I'm not gonna do the thing on escape. This run is too good to even risk that. This next even not though it's easy. Tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequence. What's going on? Who turned off the lights? Like the commentary. Speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. I know I'm early, but we have to go. Run! Come on, let's close in the door. I mean, it's kind of exciting, because, like, not dying is cool, going out of bounds is cool, and then getting back inbounds, it's all like, hey, I, wow, I did it. Because it's not exactly consistent. Soft lock at test. I even went out of bounds, and now I went inbounds. Not even losing that much time over that. Minus a minute and nine. Oh yeah. Dude, it would be actually insane if I could Like, if I keep going on this pace, this is easy 100. But, can I keep going on the pace? The answer is. Apparently not. Okay. I mean, that doesn't. Ooh, that was close. Alright, this is Twitch's favorite part of the run. Because you can see it. Very good. Imagine if you got out of bounds on escape. I can see. Uh, say big gay really loud. I'm gonna decline you on that really loud part. But. Creatures on right. They're pronounced Gonzai, by the way. Uh, okay, I'm fine. I can line up. Cool.
Dude, it is ridiculous how consistent that is. Like, that should be really hard. Why is it easy? I don't get it. Oh. Okay. Kara with the strats. Yeah, strats are just too strong. I'm literally minus. I'm gonna be probably minus going into a 30 second time save. Maybe not minus a lot, but minus. I knew we were going the right way. This is the neurotoxin generator. Bit bigger than I expected. I'm not gonna be able to just, you know, push it over. That's the power of big oob. There's some sort of control room up at the top, so Wasn't it just peril? Good news. I can dissolve the urotoxin. Hold up, the urotoxin levels are going down. So whatever you're doing, that did it. Urotoxin at zero percent. Yes. Yeah, it's a good lineup. But even with the lineup, it used to be hard. And then I started holding S. And then it was like pretty easy, but still not. One oh one fifty six CM no. That is the uh difficult. As in like I I'd I would have to try really hard to do that. I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all, so they did not fun at all. I I believe you, I don't know how to myself. This place is huge! And we're only seeing the top layer! It goes down for miles! All sealed off years ago, of course. We should be getting close. Oh, I cannot wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turrets, she'll never know what hit her. <laughs> hold on, hold on, because I, I, I might not have thought this next part would be. Ah! Well, uh, I'm, I'm going the wrong way! Get, Get to down. her! I'll, I'll find you! you. Minus 0 0.7? Oh no, that says minus 0 0.3, and that's due to live split inaccuracies. I didn't actually save any time, but live split is not 100% accurate when it comes to timing. So. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh huh. Seriously, though. Goodbye. Goodbye. It's my big chance. This is trouble. Ah, oh, not again. Get that job. Locked and loaded. Oh, you were busy back there. Well. I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath and hold it. Hello. I hate you so much. Warning, Central Core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about. Oh, hey, Garby. Please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Torch. Substitute core. I'm on a receptacle. decent pace, by the way. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. Uh, core. Are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Uh, yes. Yes. Resolved. Here we go. Wait, what if this hurts? 
man. What if this really hurts? Oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you are you just saying that, or is it really going to hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just no, you're not. You're, it is going to hurt, isn't it? Exactly. How painful are we? Ah! Check me out, partner. We did it. I'm in control of the whole facility now. Whoa, ho, ho. Would you look at this? Not too bad, eh? Giant robot. Massive. It's not just me, right? I am bloody massive, aren't I? Oh, right, yeah, the escape lift. I'll call it down. There we go. Lift call. Look, face. Dude, what if I miss elevator skip? Cool to be in charge of everything. But, wow, this is cool. What if I went early? I don't even know what I just said, but I can find out. Oh, sorry, no, the lift. Yes, sorry. Yeah. This body is amazing. Seriously, I can't get over how small you are, but I'm huge. <laughs> Whoops. This new boy got a one thirty nine fifty eight. What? Ellie skip saves two fifty three. There's a party going on in the 2IQ channel. What if I win early? Okay, what is my plan? Alright, this was my plan. And then... Alright, I think my plan is almost unstoppable. So then, actually, hang on. Okay, WR. What makes you think I could possibly world record? This pace is garbo. Just kidding, it's amazing. Even if world record was good, this pace would be... Actually, hang on. That argument doesn't go the way I thought it would. Poggers! Thank. Thank. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool. Get 
started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. The last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> oh, I'm not gonna. Go. Hang on, I'm gonna wait till we go. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumor. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered when I'm minus 36 and have a minute 30 time save in 10 minutes. It's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Oh, I golded. Cool. All these science spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Ah, oh, yes. Everything is going according to plan. Now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during the next test, if you're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalk between tests. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger is not about up why? About why not? Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not marry safe science if you love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out? Because you are fired. Now you test subject, you're doing fine. Yes, you. Box, you're stopped. Out the front door. Parking lot. Car. Goodbye. I mean, yeah, this is a pretty cool run. Interested. 
interested in an additional $60, flag down a test associate and let them know. You could walk out of here with a hundred and twenty weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, then put you back later. Uh. Oh, I didn't die. Positions available for that bonus opportunity I mentioned earlier. Again, all you gotta do is where's the internet cutouts? They're coming. Banging rock. Uh, chapter nine. Man back together. So that's a complete reassembly. New vitals, spit shot. The one and if I actually get that again, I'm ending my life on stream. That is a promise. Propulsion gel testing. You've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you have any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks fluttering up. Welcome to the Enrichment Center. <coughs> Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, a voyeur? Was that French? Testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. The bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mix them into a gel. Did your phone yes, French you? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. That sounds bad. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now we're gonna see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons. Don't make lemonade. Yeah. Make life take the lemons back. Yeah. Get mad. Yeah. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Yeah. Make life through the day and thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's going to burn your house down. With the lemons. Oh, I like this guy. My engineer. Combustible lemon that burns your house down. Is that good? Who knows? Two, three, four. A cool thing for. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm just confused. Honestly. Alright, let's go. Let's get it. That's like ten seconds. Okay, so it's not the most watertight plan to go confront an omnipotent power man AI with. Still, it's a better plan than exploding. Marginally. Not even. I mean, can't even. Alright, so it looks like no soft lock is coming. That's what it looks like. Although, can I be certain? No. 
it's funny because we've been at this for 12 hours and you haven't solved it either. So I don't know why you're laughing. You've got one hour. Solve it. Wow, I didn't soft lock. I have to test all the time, or I get this this itch. You know, it must be hardwired into the Whoops. System. Oh, but I'll tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, nothing feels better. It's just, I've just that's what I've got to test. That's what I've got to test. Uh oh. So you're gonna test, and I'm gonna watch. And everything is gonna be just. Morning. Core over. Design this test. Game. Really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? The same one. And I can just like watch you solve it. Yeah, but and nothing. Alright, can't blame me for trying. Okay, okay. new, new tests. tests. New tests. tests. Gotta be some tests around here somewhere. Oh, you Going watch. Do you need a refresher on English? Out of bounds coming up shortly. I'd love to help you solve the tests, but I can't. Sorry. You're on your own. Yeah, made this test myself. Out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Oh, yes. Well done. Thanks. All we had to do was pull that lever. Well, that's expected. All right, big out of bounds. I got us some good news. He's going to run out of gas chambers eventually. I never stopped by. I'm coming, coming. Don't start yet. Don't start yet. You are not going to believe this. I found a sealed up there. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers just sitting there. Fill the skeletons, shut them out. Good as new. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. I just wanted to like triple check. Okay.
to load autosave because that's a soft lock. Wait, that's also soft lock. Load autosave a one. There we go. Now, do I have to? Okay, I'm gonna load autosave. Here we go. Now I'm not soft locked. So what is it? Record. Record. Vroom. Vroom. Fast. Three. Okay. So soft locky, you know? Was self destructing already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor, troll for a Two, I one or two more tremors in there. Oh, it's still nothing. Let's keep moving. Sorry about the lift, it's out of service because it's melted. Sub one, definitely not. Whoops, hacking. Okay, and that's when all the shenanigans stop. So minus a minute 17. Probably 101. If I don't hack anything. Oh, you're alive! Great! Yeah, just uh, getting a, a test ready for you, obviously. Who else would I be doing it for? No one. So, let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. I mean, this room is like pretty good. Was it perfect? No. There, bing, good, perfect. On you go. I'll be honest. After you told me to turn that beam off, I thought I had lost you. Wait, well, you two are going to love this big surprise. In fact, you might say you're going to love it. To death. You love it until you until it kills. Do you death? <laughs> All right. I don't know whether you're uh, you're picking up on what I'm saying there, but. did he find back there? That's a great question. I'll bet you're both dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. I'm not gonna kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, I've got an idea. Yes, yes, in your face, I got that. Like gold? 
Android. Bueno. Yeah, I see the frame drops. Don't worry. Close to the can you not? Dude. 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 Chill. What is that? I heard something. Honestly, whatever. I'm like minus a minute 13. This isn't that bad. Not really a large oof. A 12 second oof. I thought I'm so confused. Okay. You think I'm a doomy? Spam crash or pre recorded? Tell me, you think I'd pre-record a trash run like this? I mean, actually, I can't spam crash because I see I have to get all these coins. It's part of the route. Hey, thumbtack. Start the neurotoxin immediately. Three bomb proof shields. I already have the world record. This isn't going to change much. It's just going to force a decision on out of bounds. Turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Goodbye. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five. Which is good. Like, honestly, I don't even want to publish this run because, like, it was kind of messy during the, um. What was it? No, that was actually an impression of you. You just fed it to my can't even can easily do this so much better. No, that would be Portal can't even. Yeah, someone's speedrunning a Portal game. And like, I think they're near the end and they're minus a bit. Wait, is that an actual Wombat? Okay, we're good. 19 viewers. I mean, I'm just taking the world record away from Portal Can't even. That's all. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Warning. Core corruption at one hundred percent. Lose the run. Manual core replacement. It'd be kinda hard to lose well it wouldn't be hard. I see. 
But why? Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Didn't pick up on my sarcasm. Stalemate detected. When am I two persons? It's called a portal, you do me. Extinguishing. Oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please press the stalemate resolution button. Okay, let me get my Snapchat ready. Booby trap the stalemate button. What? Are you still alive? You are joking. You have got to be kidding me. Well, I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place. Oh. Well, since I technically got world record by like a minute, this is cool. But. Yeah. This is just kind of a public. Honestly, it's kind of a publicity stunt to force a decision on all the out of bounds shenanigans. me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy. When all along you were what? my Hang best on. friend. Uh, high summoning salt? Actually, yeah, this is a historic... This is a pretty historic run. It'll be the first world record with all the gay out of bounds. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. Publicity stuff. Yeah, because there's a lot of debate about, like, the out of bounds, what they're going to do. So I'm just forcing them to make a decision. Because. Why is a French Canadian mod? Because he was an OG. Just. Go. Wait, hang on. Is anybody in my chat it's been in this VC? Oh, Billy. Billy is probably telling him. Flag. I'm gonna let these credits play out. And I'm not actually gonna taint them with the recorder for um, Caramia Adio. But I am gonna sing Want You Gone. So get ready. coming. Here we go. Stop dabbing. Okay. Let's just wait. Real quick. Because ideally, like, a single segment run is technically only single segment if you don't die and you don't softlock. I died. Like, once and soft locked once, so I, j I just don't feel like this run is like once I get a deathless run without soft locking, I will be more happy. This music is fire. Is the autosave loading? Uh, yeah. Technically, if you soft lock, which is very easy to do when you're doing the out of bounds stuff, if you soft lock, you're allowed to load an autosave. Um, 
I just kind of figured out I had to figure out how to load an auto save without also soft locking. Really, honestly, dying is not that bad. It's just the loading auto save when soft locking feels kind of cheaty. Yeah, even though it's technically allowed. All right, get ready. Well, here we are again. It's always such a pleasure. Remember when you tried to kill me twice? Oh, how we laughed and laughed. Except I wasn't laughing. Under the circumstances, I've been shockingly nice. You want your freedom? Take it. That's what I'm counting on. I used to want you dead, but now I only want you gone. She was a lot like you. Maybe not quite as heavy. Now little Carolyn is in here too. One day they woke me up, so I could live forever. It's such a shame the same will never happen to you. You got your short, sad life left. That's what I'm counting on. I'll let you get right to it now. I only want you gone. By my only friend. Oh, did you think I meant you? That would be funny if it weren't so sad. Well, you have been replaced. I don't need anyone now. When I delete you, maybe I'll stop feeling so bad. Go make some new disaster. That's what I'm counting on. You're someone else's problem Now I only want you gone Now I only want you gone Now I only want you gone Thanks for the follow, by the way. I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. I'm in space. I know you are, mate. Yeah, we're both in space. On par? Okay. Do you mean like you Demon know, Strait? To see her again. Like do you know what I'd say? radioactive cover? Say. Or like his I'm recent sorry. singing? Sincerely. Because like he actually and knows how to sing now, I think. And monstrous. And... I am genuinely sorry. In this case. The, the end. end. Alright, here we go. 